walking in the way of the cross. Blessed be our God. Forever and ever. Amen. Let us pray. Almighty God, we pray you graciously to behold this, your family, for whom our Lord Jesus Christ was willing to be betrayed and given into the hands of sinners and to suffer death upon the cross, who now lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. The way of the cross. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, Mm -hmm. hallowed hallowed be thy thy name. name. Thy kingdom Kingdom come, come, thy thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. We will glory in the cross of our Lord Jesus Christ. In whom is our salvation, our life and resurrection. Let us pray. Assist us mercifully with your help, O Lord God of our salvation, that we may enter with joy upon the contemplation of those mighty acts, whereby you have given us life and immortality. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The first station. Jesus is condemned to death. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. As soon as it was morning, the chief priests with the elders and scribes and the whole council had a consultation. And they bound Jesus and led him away and delivered him to Pilate. And they all condemned him and said, He deserves to die. When Pilate heard these words, he brought Jesus out and sat down on the judgment seat at a place called the pavement. But in the Hebrew... Gabbatha. Then he handed Jesus over to them to be crucified. God did not spare his own son, but delivered him up for us all. Let us pray. Almighty God, whose most dear son went not up to joy, but first he suffered pain and entered not into glory before he was crucified. Mercifully grant that we, walking in the way of the cross, may find it none other than the way of life and peace. Through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy holy and mighty, holy holy immortal one, have have mercy mercy upon us. The second station. Jesus takes up his cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Jesus went out bearing his own cross to the place called the place of a skull, which is called in Hebrew, Golgotha. Although he was a son, he learned obedience through what he suffered. Like a lamb, he was led to the slaughter. And like a sheep that before its shearers is mute, so he opened not his mouth. Worthy is the lamb who was slain, to receive power and riches and wisdom and strength and honor and glory and blessing. The Lord has laid on him the iniquity of us all. For the transgression of my people who was stricken. 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 Let us pray. Almighty God, whose beloved Son willingly endured the agony and shame of the cross for our redemption, give us courage to take up our cross and follow him, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. Third station, the cross is laid on the Simon of Serene. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. As they led Jesus away, they came upon a man of Serene, Simon by name, who was coming in from the country and laid on him the cross to carry it behind Jesus. If anyone would come after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow me. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light." Whoever does not bear his own cross and come after me 
cannot be my disciple. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, whose blessed Son came not to be served, but to serve, bless all who, following in his steps, give themselves to the service of others, that with wisdom, patience, and courage, they may minister to his name, to the suffering, the friendless, and the needy. For the love of him who laid down his life for us, your Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy and mortal one, have mercy upon us. Four station, Jesus meets the woman of Jerusalem. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. There followed after Jesus a great multitude of the people, and among them were women who bewailed and lamented him. But Jesus, turning to them, said, Daughters of Jerusalem, do not weep for me, but weep for yourselves and for your children. Those who sowed tears, sowed with tears, will reap with songs of joy. Let us pray. Teach your church, O Lord, to mourn the sins of which it is guilty, and to repent and forsake them, that, by your pardoning grace, the results of our iniquities may not be visited upon our children and our children's children. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. Um, this station, Jesus is stripped of his garment. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. When they came to a place called Golgotha, which means the place of a skull, they offered him wine to drink, mingled with gall. But when he tasted it, he would not drink it. And they divided his garments among them by casting lots. This was to fulfill the scripture which says, They divided my garments among them. They cast lots for my clothing. They gave me gall to eat. And when I was thirsty, they gave me vinegar to drink. Let us pray. Lord God, whose blessed Son, our Savior, gave his body to be whipped and his face to be spit upon, give us grace to accept joyfully the sufferings of the present time, confident of the glory that shall be revealed. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. Sixth station, Jesus is nailed to the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross and have redeemed the world. When they came to the place which is called the skull, there they crucified him. And with him they crucified two criminals, one on the right, the other on the left, and Jesus between them. And the scripture was fulfilled, which says, He was numbered with the transgressors. They pierce my hands and my feet. They stare and gloat over me. Lord Jesus Christ, you stretched out your arms of love on the hard wood of the cross that everyone might come within reach of your saving embrace. So clothe us in your spirit that we, reaching forth our hands in love, may bring those who do not know you to the knowledge and love of you. For the honor of your name, amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy and mortal one, have mercy upon us. Seventh station, Jesus dies on the cross. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. When Jesus saw his mother and the disciple whom he loved standing near, he said to his mother, Woman, behold your son. Then he said to the disciple, Behold your mother. And when Jesus had received the vinegar, he said, It is finished. And then, crying with a loud voice, he said, Father, into your hands I commend my spirit. And he bowed his head, and he handed over his spirit. Christ for us became obedient unto death. Even death on a cross. Let us pray. O God, for who our redemption gave your only begotten Son to the death of the cross, and by his glorious resurrection delivered us from the power of our enemy, grant us so to die daily to sin, that we may evermore live with him in the joy of his resurrection, who lives and reigns now and forever. Amen. 
Holy, holy God, God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, one, have mercy upon us. Jesus is laid in the tomb. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. When it was evening, there came a rich man from Arimathea named Joseph, who was also a disciple of Jesus. He went to Pilate and asked for the body of Jesus. Then Pilate ordered it to be given to him. And Joseph took the body and wrapped it in a clean linen shroud and laid it in his own new tomb, which he had hewn in the rock. And he rolled a great stone to the door of the tomb. You will not abandon me to the grave. Nor let your holy one see corruption. Let us pray. O God, your blessed Son was laid in a tomb in a garden and rested on the Sabbath day. Grant that we who have been buried with him in the waters of baptism may find our perfect rest in his eternal and glorious kingdom, where he lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy immortal one, have mercy upon us. Savior of the world, by your cross and precious blood, you have redeemed us. Save us and help us, we humbly beach you, O Lord. Let us pray. We thank you, Heavenly Father, that you have delivered us from the dominion of sin and death and brought us into the kingdom of your Son. And we pray that, as by his death, he has recalled us to life. So by his love, he may raise us to eternal joys who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Amen. To Christ our Lord who loves us and washed us in his own blood and made us a kingdom of priests to serve his God and Father, to him be glory and dominion forever and ever. Amen. Amen.